There are some problems, however. As you mentioned earlier, New York Community Bank Corps is is pretty famous among in the banking world, I guess, um, for having an absolutely amazing efic- efficiency ratio of 46%. Now, for efficiency ratios, the lower they are, the better. Astoria Financial is coming into this deal with an efficiency ratio of 74%. And a big part of that is it could possibly be traced to the fact that Astoria tends to outsource its mortgage origination. New York Community Bank Corps is really careful about who it lends to, um, and it, that helps keeps its costs down because they don't have to write off loans. And they do most of that process in-house, and that means that they have a greater incentive to um, make sure that the loans they write are good, since that's Astoria outsources its um, its mortgage origination. The people who write those those loans maybe don't have as much of an incentive to make sure that the the loans are going to be definitely fulfilled. Yeah, and and you know, if there's there are a number of kind of negative aspects of the deal, if you're a shareholder or a per, prospective shareholder. That is definitely, I would say, that's one of the was one of the top three. But you know, if you think about it, you know, one of the things that you know you mentioned is the fact that New York Community Bank or its efficiency ratio. And, and just to be clear, the efficiency ratio, what this does is it takes a bank's operating expenses or its non-interest expenses and it divides those by its net revenue. So this tells you what percentage of net revenue is being consumed by operating expenses. The corollary of this is that it, it tells you what percentage of net revenue is then free to pass the bottom line or cover loan loss provisions or pay taxes or distribute to shareholders, right? So lower, a lower efficiency ratio is a better efficiency ratio. Well, New York Community Bancors has always been in the 40 to 50% range, which is an extremely low ratio. When you consider that even great banks like U.S. Bank Corps, Wells Fargo, their ratios are in the low 50% range. And I mean, these are really well-run banks. Well, the problem is that you know, with New York Community Bank Corps bringing a story financial and its 75% efficiency ratio, 74% efficiency ratio onto its balance sheet, that it's going to dilute that really large competitive advantage of New York Community Bank Corps. And the other problem, and this is, this is the point that you're getting to with a story financial outsourcing its mortgages. So a story financial, it's, it's a based in the New York area as well, which is a benefit to New York Community Bank Corps in this merger. But the problem is that its balance sheet, the majority of the assets on its balance sheet are residential mortgages. And where does it get those residential mortgages? My reading of its financial uh, uh, statements is that it outsources the majority of those, the origination of those mortgages to other banks or other mortgage brokers and then purchases those mortgages. What we have seen throughout the years, most recently in the financial crisis, and we saw it again in the 1980s with the failure, with the, really the first too big to fail bank, Continental Illinois, it did the same thing. These banks got into trouble by having other people make the credit decisions on the loans on their balance sheet. And the problem with that is that the bank that keeps that loan on its balance sheet has the most incentive to make sure that it's underwriting a really, really good loan. So it's, just, it's not a guarantee that outsourcing your mortgages or, or, your, or your lending operations is going to be a bad thing, but it certainly increases the possibility that there's going to be a problem down the road with your loans. Um, and, and, and that really... Those, if you're going to look at you know, kind of the negative or the thorns, if you will, uh, of this deal for, from the perspective of a New York Community Bank or shareholder, those, in my opinion, are, are really it. 